Yeah. Every time this song come on, can't stop, won't stop. When King Kong's come on, it's time to turn the song off. And it's his song. That's so crazy. But what's up, y'all? Um, I am on the way to see my boyfriend. Um, what's going on with my hair right there? See my boyfriend, and then I'm gonna go to Home Goods because y'all, I am on a hunt to find this cute Hello Kitty fall cup. When I tell y'all, it's so cute. It's so cute. So. I saw it like two days ago um, while I was on Instagram. Um, Y'all know how when you start liking certain things on Instagram, your explore page starts showing you all that stuff. So I've been obsessed with like Hello Kitty and y'all know I love cups. So I see a lot of that on my explore page. And this um, lady had posted this cute Hello Kitty like um, tumbler and it was like a fall inspired tumbler and it was only $6.99 I know that I'm addicted to cups but at the same time I need people to know that I create content so like this is on brand and it's the season is about to change it's about to be fall so I feel like it's only right to get a new fall cup for my fall coffee content like and it's only seven dollars it's not like i'm going to go buy another 20 30 dollar starbucks cup so hopefully i find it um last night me and my boyfriend went to mo's and there was the marshall's over there y'all know marshall's tj maxx and home goods are like sister companies so i thought maybe marshall's would have it and they did have some cute cups they had like um I forgot what that movie's called with the skeleton guy, the little Disney movie. They had him and then they had Hocus Pocus. So they gave me hope that they had the um they gave me hope that they had the cup, but um they did. So um I just went to no, I just went to um another y'all every time i come up here we always trying to do that and it's so aggravating I'm like get away from people's car but anyways he made me lose my train of thought yes, he does. what's up y'all so back in the car left home goods didn't record in there the one was running for two i was trying to focus and like go in there and try to find what i came for and it was a lot of people but i found it we found it y'all it is so cute hold on it has a little scratch on it but look at it hello kitty and then it says pumpkin spice and everything nice and it has little leaves and a little pumpkin spice latte how cute so cute it's so cute, I don't care. So, yeah, I got that and then I ended up getting my little sister a little mug because she likes to drink some tea sometimes and she has so many mugs and she actually drinks out of them. So, yeah, and then last night we were having our little sister talk and she told me that she loved Halloween, like, that was her favorite so i saw this my my sister is like a kid that's not really scared of a lot of things she likes spooky things i feel like a lot of little kids are like that so um i didn't want to get her mug that was like too like kitty like i wanted to get her something that was a little bit more dark <laughs> but not like you know what i mean so i got this black mug and it has like a skeleton driving in a car with a cat and two pumpkins and i thought this was cute and it says happy halloween on the handle so i got her that that was only 3.99 so i can't wait to go home and give her that right now i'm about to 
go into Target. I already got on my seatbelt. What am I doing? But I'm about to go into Target and just look around. Um, I don't really need anything, but since I'm right here, we might as well. So let's go. So in Target, y'all, and I had saw the little um, sweatpants that the girls were picking up in here. And baby, they $25 for one pair of sweats. I think not. Like, I just can't be picking up random things. $25 is my gas tank. Like, I'm not. So, I only got two things right now. And I was thinking about going to Starbucks, but I don't know because I already got food. And I'm going to go get seafood later, so I probably won't. But I probably won't, but I probably will. We'll see. I'm about to go check out, but I just wanted to come and say that. I did not know those sweats were $25. Like, that's OD what's up y'all so out of target um i end up going to starbucks i know i know i said i wasn't but why not so i got a matcha with sweet cream cold foam and brown sugar syrup i got a grande but then the guy brought it out and was like oh i just made it as a venti for you so look at god blessing me and it's so good so, got that. I got a toothbrush. This was only a dollar. And then I got some coffee because I did run out of coffee, which I could have got coffee from anywhere, but I did need it. So, I did need some things from Target. So, yeah. Um, I got the Starbucks cold brew. Y'all know I've been liking that busy coffee, but I've only seen it in Walmart. So, I'll have to make a trip back to Walmart very soon. But I love the Starbucks cold brew. It's just as good as the um, Busy Coffee. And then I got this book that everybody is talking about. Yes, I'm easily influenced and that is okay. Because I'm an influencer. I influence people. And people influence me. And that's okay. So I got this Colleen. Colleen. Hoover book is called it ends with us currently I'm reading a book right now um called what is it called I forgot what it's called about a little real quick um it's called oh the coldest winter ever um I got this from Amazon so I'm currently reading this but I plan on finishing this book really soon because while we were on the way to Miami I was reading it like the whole way there and I stopped because I was like oh my god if I keep reading it I'm gonna finish and then when I get home I'm gonna have nothing to read so getting this book is going to motivate me to read the other book but the other book is actually really really good so I'm kind of excited to um start back reading it so once i'm done with that i'll start this hopefully it lives up to the hype and yeah i will see you guys i guess when i get home um also y'all while i was at the little starbucks um line the girl was like you're so pretty you're so cute i love your outfit and y'all this is what i'm wearing i love this top um i thrifted it and it's so freaking cute i think it's so cute and then i just got on some shorts and then i wore my yeezys but i really think what be getting people is like the jewelry i feel like when you wear jewelry it just puts your look together so i just have on all my crystal bracelets i have on two rings from sheen my pandora ring i have on this little bracelet that i got from sheen bracelet from amazon my pandora bracelet i have on some hoops from marshall's and then i'm wearing my louis vuitton never full with the initials on it yeah mm -hmm. so yeah that made me feel so good because your girl is giving and when other people tell me i'm giving that's how i know i'm giving all right see y'all later y'all so my boyfriend got me this candle warmer um and i'm about to test it out so apparently i don't have to light the candle i just plug it up and it just warms the candle so let's try it all right y'all so i unplug i mean i unplugged my little uh wax warmer so now we're gonna use the candle warmer and i'm gonna turn it on i don't hold on how you turn it on okay the light came on and 
Let me read the instructions. It says use to warm candles without matches, open flame or smoke, release fragrance without flame, on off switch. So basically you just sit it on there. So candle of choice today is this vanilla bean candle that I got from Marshalls. And I'm gonna come back in like 20 minutes and I'm gonna let y'all know if it actually works. But super cool concept, so yeah. What's up y'all? So as y'all saw earlier, I made some breakfast um, right now. Uh, just straightening up my room a bit. Hopefully I'm centered. But yeah, just straightening up my room a bit. I got a few things, well two things from Sephora on Friday that I want to show y'all. So the first thing I got was this K. Ali um, Love Fest perfume. Um, the scent is Burning Cherry and guys... It smells so good it's such a different scent something that I've never smelled before It's so good and also I got the um, green tea spinach vitamin superfood cleanser from youth to the people um, I tried a sample size of this last year and I really like it so I decided to upgrade to this big bottle because it is super expensive it's like 30 bucks so I wanted to test it out to make sure I liked it first so yeah, I wanted to show y'all those two things because I didn't show y'all when I first got them. I'm about to finish cleaning my room, take this mask off, and I will see you guys maybe tomorrow. But um, this perfume, y'all, I want to talk to y'all about it more, but my camera's about to die. It's so, 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 so good. Alright, y'all, so it's later in the day, and I just meal prepped this. This is white rice, well, white jasmine rice with some seasoned ground chicken. It's giving very healthy. I have broccoli in the oven that I'm gonna put with this and I'm gonna eat this throughout the week for work. So I'll come back once the broccoli is finished. So this is how much rice I have left. And then I have the ground chicken and also, also have some diced up chicken. I was gonna make some pasta with the Trader Joe's. Hold on, let me show you my face. So yeah, I was gonna make some pasta with the um, Trader Joe's Cajun Alfredo pasta, whatever, but it was nasty. It was so nasty and I tried to like doctor it up, put some seasonings in there to make it taste better and it just was not given and I did not wanna waste my chicken in that. So I'll probably have to go to Publix or somewhere tomorrow to get more rice so I can have more rice to eat with the chicken. Cause I'm pretty sure this is not gonna be enough. And yeah, I'm mad because I had high hopes for that because the regular Alfredo from Trader Joe's was good, but this was not good. So I didn't wanna waste my food. So we're just gonna do the ground chicken rice with the broccoli. Probably can eat on that for two days and then I'll have to do something else with the diced chicken. I already ate some of the diced chicken with rice for like dinner. I'm out of breath y'all because I did a lot. I made white rice, broccoli, chicken, pasta. And yeah, just for the pasta to turn out nasty. So once this broccoli is finished, it's pretty much finished. So I'm about to show y'all. Give me one second. All right, y'all. So this is how it looks with the broccoli and the rice and the ground chicken. Don't have a lot of room, but yeah. Nice, healthy, and I'm gonna be super full, so bye right y'all so i literally just got off work i went hold on let me turn off my radio i just got off work i went to Publix after work but i don't feel like like taking the stuff in the house and showing y'all so i'm gonna show y'all while i'm in a car so the first thing i got was some um salmon i'm gonna cook this uh for my mom for dinner um i got my favorite ice cream which is this Jenny's brown butter and almond brittle is so good. 
um i got some italian sausage some ground turkey and then that is butter uh the next bag i got some thin spaghetti i really like the thin spaghetti when i'm making my spaghetti i got more jasmine rice y'all know i just well i didn't just discover it but i just started using it um and i ran out of the one that i got from trader joe's so i got more rice because y'all know that i cooked that um ground chicken and i made like some chicken bites so i want to kind of finish that out and take that for lunch even though i'm making spaghetti i'm kind of making this because i don't have anything to eat for dinner tonight and then um you know i still will have like two more days to like meal prep so hopefully that holds me over for dinner and then the rest of the meal prep for the week and then i got this jar so um my mom can make kool-aid because she threw out the other jar so i got that if it goes back in the bag child the next thing i got y'all sorry all right so the next few things i got guys was the spaghetti sauce so i got roasted garlic and herb and then we got italian sausage and garlic and then i got the well, some garlic powder because spaghetti is supposed to be very much garlicky. And then the last thing is just straight up coffee. So I got this Cold Stone creamer for my mom. And then I got this Sweet Cream Planet Oat Oat Milk creamer for myself. I was trying to find the cheapest creamer in there, y'all. Honestly, I have so many syrups. So like the flavor of the creamer doesn't matter i usually stick with sweet cream vanilla and caramel this was one of the most inexpensive ones that they had um and i went to public so y'all know Publix is super pricey and then they had the busy cold brew y'all i was just telling y'all how much i liked it and i didn't find it in target when i went um and that i had to go to walmart and today i saw it in Publix. i don't remember ever seeing it in Publix, but anyways i got two of these they were buy one get one free so this is the breakfast blend and then the other one i got is just the espresso i don't feel like taking it out i'm so tired y'all hold on let me show y'all myself y'all look at my mama fish i cook Ooh! girl that don't look so good i want a piece y'all this was the spaghetti a picture on my phone because this was the aftermath i tore it up it was good i made it too spicy but it was good or whatever y'all so i just got off and i forgot that i told my co-workers that i would go to get lunch i mean go to happy hour with them so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to be a team player in sport and just go and my favorite co-worker is going so let's see how this goes okay i'll see y'all there of course i'm not taking my camera but i'll record what we got and everything like that so see y'all in like two minutes well for y'all it'll be one second but it takes me two minutes to get there so bye what's up y'all good morning so i'm at work um having a rough morning today but i'm gonna push through um happy friday i just wanted to come and show y'all the drink that i got today this is a matcha with french vanilla swirl extra french vanilla and then i got the pumpkin cold foam on top and then she also added like some sprinkles of cinnamon so let's try it mmm is so good but um i have a video coming out tuesday that you guys will be seeing super duper soon on me trying um the duncan fall drink so you guys will see which one was my favorite um but you guys definitely should try this out and i will see you guys um after i get off work bye what's up y'all so i just got off work um i'm heading home i am so tired guys i y'all know i told y'all this morning that i was just having a rough morning and i end up just having a hello all right y'all that was my co-worker I, I, I honestly forgot what i was saying all in all my morning was rough um my 
day was pretty rough because I was just so ready to go home. Um, and I was just in my feelings. I was just ready to go. Um, but I'm about to go home and honestly, I need to decompress for a bit. So I'm gonna go home, take a shower, um, and probably chill for a bit. But I do need to start editing this vlog because I haven't touched it. But this vlog won't be that long. So it shouldn't take too much time for me to edit um i was gonna give you guys a vlog today which is friday but like i told y'all i was trying to change my upload schedule so yeah i have more time to edit that i feel like it'll just benefit me and you guys as well because i just feel like giving like so much content friday and then come back with a video on sunday i don't know i just feel like it don't give y'all no time to miss me and even though it's not like super about the views i do want to see if my views change go up or go down once i start posting on um tuesday so it's just i'm just trying to find different strategies and what works for me what works for y'all and yeah i feel like um like i said it will just be better for me i will have more time to edit and um and also more time to record so um yeah once i get home i'm gonna do all of that i'm gonna get me some ice cream i have ice cream in the house and i'm gonna eat some ice cream i have a three-day weekend because of labor day so i'm really just gonna be chilling this weekend getting as much rest as i can because I need it. I, I really need it. I feel like once I came back from Miami, I had like one day to rest and I was just back to work. So it's just like, yeah. So just wanted to come update y'all and talk to y'all for a bit. And um, I don't, I'm pretty sure, I don't know y'all. This might be the end of the video. Um, I don't know. I might come back to y'all. I might not. So if I do, see y'all later. If I don't, see y'all in the next video. Bye.